Morning, bestie pops. So, oh, I hate the way the towel looks when it's hung up drying. Um, I woke up so late today because I took a melatonin gummy too late last night. I woke up at 10 o'clock and I heard the dogs barking. That's what woke me. And I was like, oh my God, see, they're super early or like a little bit late. 10 o'clock. I slept the whole day away. I think I needed though because I really wasn't sleeping well, but that's besides the point. Um, so I have to shower now. I'm having some trouble with yesterday's vlogmas going up. For some reason, it was like two minutes shorter than it was supposed to be when I uploaded it. So I had to take it down. Now it's re uploading so annoying <laughs> i hate technical difficulties it's so frustrating um i'm gonna shower now i don't think i'm gonna wear makeup today um i don't have anything like crazy to take pictures of or any like sponsored content and i just don't feel like it uh and i'm going to get a wax at one o'clock so it's 11 now um and yeah we're gonna do a haul. I have some stuff coming today and some stuff came yesterday, so I wanna show you guys. And what else do I say we're gonna do today? Haul, maybe put my Christmas tree up, maybe. Um, I kinda have to clear out the space in my room where it's gonna go first, so that might even go to tomorrow. But I did buy some Christmas pillows, so we can at least like Christmas-fy, christmas, -fy, christmas -fy my bed. <laughs> I wish I had a Christmas throw blanket, but um, Colleen got me a really cute beige, um blanket last year with like my initials on it i might use that one so we'll see yeah okay so i'm gonna shower and get ready and then update you after this i'm probably just gonna make sure my video goes up and get dressed and maybe have something to eat before i go but probably not knowing me <laughs> hello besties i have to take my bun out and realize that was still up <laughs> it's disgusting out we're gonna get a coffee and then go to my wax. I hope my hair looks all right, damn. Um, because why make one at home when I really want an Irish cream cold brew? So that's kind of the vibe. I, I'm trying different angles of my camera in the car, but I know I bought a car mount, and but now I can't find it. So that's the struggle where I'm at. So I don't wanna buy a new one if I already have one. But okay, I will update you when we get to Starbucks. I'm thinking I'm gonna get an Irish cream cold brew. I ordered my, oh, my hair looks fucking nuts. Um, I ordered my Venti Irish cream cold brew. I was jamming to the Big Booty remixes. This line is taking forever today, like the longest I've waited in a long time. Um, yeah, I really want my coffee. I texted Colleen to see if she can get lunch after my wax, but who knows? I feel like she has such a wild schedule being a nurse and whatnot. Um, I have something coming in the mail tomorrow and like, I don't know what it is. That happens sometimes. Yeah, I don't, I have no idea what that is. Sometimes I try to like match it up with my shop app if I know I have something coming, but no clue stay tuned for that mystery package tomorrow <laughs> um what was delivered today oh my god all our packages were delivered today okay so later we'll do a haul for sure okay colleen maybe we can do lunch okay so that's a maybe on lunch with colleen so she said it would be a late lunch before she goes back to work yeah okay that's fire because i'm not really honestly i thought that um, Prolon cleanse was really good, but now I just feel like it's totally messed me up. Like I'm barely hungry and I'm getting full so fast, which I, I guess some people might see as good, but to me it's more of like an inconvenience. Like I'm trying to cook and eat for TikTok and, um, I can't. Oh, I forgot I have to pay. Hi. Thank you so much. Ah, uh, that's okay. Thank you. No shade at Starbucks, but he didn't even look at me, so I was like, mm -hmm. I forgot I had to pay. How funny is that? <laughs> um. I think I'm gonna go live on TikTok for a little bit because I've been trying to go live every day. Um, 
just so they don't feel neglected on there because you know vlogmas does take up most of my attention in december so i'm gonna pull over into a random parking lot hopefully there's good like reception here because sometimes when it like goes in and out it's like obviously not great to watch so wow why is this parking lot so crowded whoa bro and so much shut it out in front of me like a momo like a moron what does everyone have to get at Best Buy today? God damn. Well, I'm gonna park right here. Great, 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 great. Okay, so I think I'm gonna go live on TikTok right now, but here's my coffee in all her glory. Let me take a photo of it. Sometimes I love the way my French nails look, other times I hate them. <laughs> Oh wow, we just got a lot of that cream, delicious. Mm, wow, that's really yummy. Okay, I'm gonna go live and then I'll try to pop in when I'm getting my wax. Maybe not during the wax, but <laughs> when I'm there. Hi besties, oh my god, I already see this whole stuff. Um, I just got back from, is this focused on me? Yes walking the dogs and we're gonna do a little unboxing haul because we got some stuff in the mail. So I think we'll start with this big box from Michaels. I kind of remember what I ordered, kind of don't. So that's always fun. There's very Christmassy stuff in here from what I remember. So I'm not gonna look what's in there. Okay, what do we got? First things first cupcake holders. I got snowflakes and these fun candy cane looking cupcake holders. So that's fun. Um, I think I know what this is. Yep. So I got these really fun for the dining room table Christmas tree tapered candles to put in candle holders. They have some glitter on them, which I wasn't expecting. Ooh, it was the, I don't know, how's the focus on that? So I got two of those. Let me put all this stuff over here. Unwrap this. I do need to put some like pottery stuff in storage. So this is good timing that this stuff came. So I got four candles in total. There's two in a package. And I got a Snapchat. Don't want to open it up right away. Don't want to seem too eager. <laughs> okay. I got two pants. I don't remember getting this one. I know I got it on sale. I think I got this half price. They are little baby bunt cakes. I thought it'd be fun to make individual cakes. This is coming back to me why I ordered this. Um, yeah, I think I got this for $10, which is a steal because it was 20, so that's fun. And then I've never seen this before, a brownie pan. I thought that was such a good idea instead of me cutting brownies myself. Boom, brownie pan, very cool. I know I got this for like $10 too, which is awesome. Okay, let's so get that stuff. And then, I think I got two of these because I needed to hit a certain threshold to get something for free. Um, I got one for my mom and then I guess one for me eventually. I got these for like $5 too, I think. These cute little Christmassy butter knife, cheese spreading knife, whatever. And they have a the little like mistletoe holly thing on them. I just thought that was so cute. So that's all Christmassy stuff. I'm gonna save the box because I need to pack up some stuff. Nice. Okay. Now moving on to my Bloomingdale's package. This is a really big box for what I'm pretty sure I know what's in here. Um, and then I did get some stuff from Bloomingdale's sent yesterday. It came in like two separate packages. So we will show everything at once. And then I got a really pun, pun, <laughs> fun pair of shoes, but the camera is resting on them right now. So I'll show those last. And I think there was something else coming today. Oh, they sent these in like garment bags. That's why this box is so big. Okay, these are like two holiday dresses. 
what a waste of everything to send me this. Okay. I guess I'll unknot the bottom. Bloomingdale's is my go-to for any type of like occasion-y dress situation because their aqua line is my favorite. I don't know why I feel like I should save this thing. I don't know. It's really just like a glorified garbage bag, but okay. Okay. Oh, this is so different than what I was expecting. Cause you know, why shop in person when I can just order something online and be surprised. Um, so it's, I was thinking this is like a fun, like New Year's Eve or birthday dress. I got it in a large. It is like a white bow on top with this little crystal situation. And then the bottom is velvet, which I didn't know, but it looks so cute. I'm gonna have to do a try on of this for you guys. So pretty, um, very holiday-esque, which was the vibe. This I sized up in cause I saw people saying I should, but now I feel like it looks too big. Okay, well, it's just like this baby doll dress and if, you know what, if it's a little big, maybe this will be good because, you know, holidays you eat a lot, so <laughs> maybe I need more room. Um, it just looks really big. I don't know. But it's like a floral brocade. Is that how you pronounce that? I don't know. I just thought it'd be really sweet with tights and like a platform black shoe. It's actually like a navy color. I don't know if it's picking up, but it looks more black probably. Um, these are both the aqua line at Bloomingdale's, my favorite. And then the stuff I got yesterday, I got this dress on sale. Again, I sized up in it, but because it was the only one left and I was like, you know what, I mean, if it is a little big, but I'm usually a large, but I sized up because I wanted it for $20. <laughs> it's a little bit big, but again, whatever. It's not like uh, too noticeable that it's big and it was just such a steal and I really like the color and like the pattern on it so I'll try all these on for you guys because obviously you can't tell what these look like it's just like an a-line dress and then the neckline kind of like if I can show <laughs> goes like this and then it kind of like ties like that around your neck I'm gonna try it on for you guys um so you can see what I mean so cute and then I got a shacket on sale. Again, I sized up because either they didn't have my size or maybe I just wanted this big. I don't know. I have another shacket from them in a large. And now once I tried this on, I did think like, should I just gotten a large? Cause it's a little bit like possibly too big, but whatever, comfy, cozy. It's just like this red flannel shacket. The quality is so nice. It's like thick, but not too thick. It has pockets. I like the buttons on it. They're like a, a woody brown kind of color. I don't think that focused, but really cute. I think I got this for like $30. It's like, what was it originally? 118. So that was a steal. I never buy anything full price from Bloomingdale's, like clothes, I refuse. And then I got two pajama sets. These are so comfy, they're inside out because I tried them on last night. Um, hold on. I got them in pink and navy, and honestly, I just got these more as like lounge around the house sets when I want to be comfy, but somewhat put together. So it's these like thermally tops. This is the pink, and then this is the navy. I didn't realize the navy had red buttons. I must have overlooked that detail because they are giving like pajama more than I thought. That, and then they just have matching joggers in the color. They're just like a slim fit, super comfy, cozy jogger. The material is so nice. Um, so love that. And then last but not least, shoes that came in. Mm. This was like, what is this? Oh, my receipt. Yeah, I got those dresses half price basically. So that was great. Um, and now for the shoes, you're actually on the shoe box. So I'm gonna have to put you down for a second but I'll you know we'll adjust I got these on super sale from nine west not me having to crouch now um because a girl on tiktok had them in silver and I was like I need those and this was the only color left in my size they are these cute little pink pumps but then they tie around your ankle and they're just the perfect heel height like they're not too high and I went to Stuart Weitzman in the mall a little while ago and they had a very similar pink pump without the tie that I really liked. So I love the tie aspect of these. They are just so cute. They look so good on. 
and they're just really cute. I think I had something else coming in the mail today, but I guess it didn't come yet. Or maybe I'm just like losing my mind. Let me look. No, I got something else. I don't want to ruin it now, but it says it was delivered, but I don't think it was. Unless it was delivered just right now. Okay, I'm going to check and then come right back to you guys. Okay, I was right. Another package did come. I was going to ask Santa for these, but they go out of stock so quickly that I was like... I didn't want to have to wait for Santa to like get around to ordering this whenever she feels like it. <laughs> and then they'd be out of stock. So they had my size. I jumped on them because I ordered these from Bloomingdale's. They, the order went through and they said, nope, like out of stock. Sorry. So like, oop, I really got to find them now. I found them on forward. I can maybe like open the box actually. <laughs> okay. Huh. is like cemented down okay yay they always come not in a box which i kind of forgot about now i have boxes even more to pack up some stuff okay i got a new pair of moon boots last year i got the pink ones because it was all they had in my size and i thought they were so cute and this year i was like girl why don't you get a little bit of like a practical color that you can actually wear so I used to be a big, big, big Ugg snow boot girl. I have two pairs of those. But I feel like those are like, I don't know. I feel like those will get ruined more easily. So these are like nylon snow boots that are easier to like, oh, I need to undo. Okay, I got the black ones. And there are like an all black version, like the writing is black and everything else. But I liked these because I like kind of like the white writing with a little bit of contrast. These are the best snow boots ever because um, they are so comfy and I just love them. And they make your legs look so tiny and like snatched because these are just like a big chunky boot. I'm not really into the high ones on me just because I have short legs. So I feel like they'll just swallow me up. So I love the short ones and I do have wide calves but I've tried on a taller one once and it, it fit I just I don't like the way it looks and these are just easier on and off so very into the short little mini ones they're just so freaking cute especially with like leggings just like a big winter jacket like it's kind of a look without even trying and I just love them I feel like a, like a Salt Lake City Utah mom in these with like in the best way or like a revolve girly which I am neither of but a girl can dream and they're just so cute, you know? So that's my whole haul. Can I try one on for you? So I never know which one is which. Like maybe this is the left boot. They should really have a thing like left or right on them, but they like don't. Do they? No. <laughs> I feel like it's always on the wrong foot. They're so cute. I don't really show my crotch, but right right giving cutesy cutesy tootsie bootsy <laughs> i think they're so cute here look at this way <laughs> i love these they're so comfy and like plush too the black is so cute okay i'm so happy about this maybe if my mom doesn't have like enough gifts on the trail tell her she can wrap these up because it hasn't snowed yet so she wants like extra presents under for me to unwrap <laughs> as we get older I feel like the presents get less and more expensive you know what I mean like when you're younger there's like a lot of toys like toys 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 and now when you're older like things cost more so maybe there's like 10 gifts and I used to be like 20 when you were little I don't know just my own thought um okay I might go to lunch with Colleen I'll keep you posted on that still not hungry which is concerning um, so yeah, I'll keep you posted. Bye. I'm definitely in a better mood today. Like, I just feel good. And like, I love me going on a rant after I just said bye. I love going to get waxed because I, my friend Dana is my waxer and like, I just love catching up with her and like, I think we're gonna go out to dinner. Me, her, my friend Liam soon. I have to text them both right now. So yeah. Okay, update. Me and Colleen are not getting lunch. Of course my battery's dead. Of course it is. Um, I'm getting annoyed because I'm kind of hungry and I just, I'm not in the mood for anything specific. Which is the worst, because then I just want to get like chicken nuggets or something, something easy. I don't know, I'm getting hungry, but I don't know what to eat.
Okay, we settled on a very hearty <laughs> sourdough turkey bacon BLT with avocado. So very excited about this. I used my sandwich picks to keep it together and it's so cute. I think I'm gonna have some chips on the side of it too. We're finishing up folding our laundry, right? Six hours Watching next. Entourage. But we just finished folding some laundry, right? And we're still putting it away. But you wanted to come up here and sit with me, right? Oh my god, I cannot take how cute Teddy is. So naturally, I want that this to hold. Um, I have some clothes and stuff on here. But I want this to be where I put my tree. So I have to put that pottery in storage. That pottery, those things. And these are my fashion pass clothes I have to like do something with. Um, and these are the shoes I showed you guys before. I'm so obsessed with those pink pumps. They're so cute. And we put my laundry away, right? We redid my pajama drawers. It looks a little messy actually still, but everything's like folded and put away nicely. So those are the new pajamas I showed you guys earlier. It's a little bit stuffed, but it's good. And I can't stop watching Entourage lately. I'm literally obsessed. Okay, so... I've made some progress in my room on my laundry. I'm gonna go hang out with a friend for a little bit. So I guess I'm gonna sign off for the night. I hope today's video wasn't too short. Sorry, love you, bye.